Hi all, this is Charles. Um, I'm 45 years old. I'm stepping up to do the videos like Rachel suggested. Um, there are definitely a lot of people out there who've been doing videos and this is my first. You get to see in the background uh, my cat sleeping on my bed. My room is a disaster. Um, I live like a teenager even though yes I am 45 years old. Uh, but hello to everybody. Um, <clears throat> I'm pre-everything. Uh, I will be having my first surgery coming up on April 22nd. I'll be having a hysterectomy, uh, more for medical reasons than for um, uh, transition, but it's still, I, I still look at it as a win-win situation for myself. It's something I've been wanting for a long time, and it, it's the, a step in the right direction. Um, I have money saved up for top surgery, but I'm not in a rush to get that done, you know, mostly because um, I'll be missing a lot of work. Um, I have to work to support myself and my daughter, uh, but it's a step. It's my first step, you know. Like so many people, you know, I don't have, you know, everything I could possibly want. I don't have supportive parents. Um, I don't have a lot of money. There's so many of us who are in the same situation, but don't give up. It's, you know, you'll get there. You know, the young people, you know, it seems pretty hopeless right now. You know, I've been this way my whole life. Um, I realized at a very early age, like so many of us, that I was different, that, that something wasn't right about my body. And I did nothing has felt right ever since. And this is the first time in my life I feel right. Something feels right. And I've just ordered new binders. Hopefully I'll get ones that fit this time. <laughs> so I won't have to cut myself out of them again. Um, I did the measurements. I took a lot of steps to make sure I get the right things. Um, not just guess. You know? <laughs> so um, big shout out to Tommy Lynn, to Rachel, to Lisi. Um, I'm dedicating this video to my friend Erica. Um, I've known her for about 10 years. She was like one of the first trans people I was ever really close close with. And I do still look up to her very often. She's a wonderful, wonderful woman. Just had, her, had finished having her surgeries last year. And um, <clears throat> so I'm really proud of her, proud to have known her. You know, <laughs> What can I say? There's so many great people in the community, you know, you just got to keep going forward. And so I wanted to shout out to, hey, everybody, Alex, you know, don't give up, man. You know, the depression might get to you sometimes, but it's, it can get better. You know, you got to keep fighting. Max, you know, you're a great guy. Everybody, everybody I've met, to all the friends I've had, I have, to the friends I haven't even met yet, um, we're all a bunch of great people, you know, and we're here to support each other. And so, with that, I'm going to end this video, and so hopefully somebody else can step forward and take their turn. Have a good night. Take care.